Welcome to SFO2 News, Episode 5. It's been a long time, but we're back. We got a lot of stuff to cover. Here we go. First off, the park is getting ready for 4th of July. They got lots of tents set up, or structures, I guess, and they have their red, white, and blue lights on. Also, if you paint around over here, the front gate also has railing around the fountain, probably for some sort of protection show on the front gate. Mexico has had some painting happen. The gazebo and one of the murals for a shop. Now it's time for the El Diablo update. But a little thing I heard from a worker is that they're trying to have it open by this Wednesday. But he doesn't think it'll happen, but he thinks that it will be open by this week. Let's see. Wow, look at it peeking over the sign. This is going to be awesome. Here's a look at the queue line. You can kind of see that they have goblin statues up on every other podium. Also, they have the red shade covering. They have new white posts right over there. They got a lot of railing. They're putting in some red rock down there. Also, they paved up the entire and right there is the exit. Also, it was shown that this past Saturday they were testing the lights around the circle. And it definitely was very bright. They've also put up the sign. Most likely that will what will be up there. So there's another angle of some of those hard blows. construction wall there, an abandoned ride there, and an abandoned queue line here. Well, that'll do it for this SFOT News. Remember, stay over Texas.